Jacksonville, the surrounding area, has a lot of swimming talent, an inordinate amount, quite frankly, between everything that goes on at the University of Florida, the bowl school, and here at Episcopal. Finish! But there's really nothing in the water, except for the blood, sweat, and tears. You're not drinking the water, are you? That last 20 to 5, we need to swim through the finish. Oh, and outstanding coaching as well. Martin Zubero is the head coach here at Episcopal with the Amberjacks. The man has been to three Olympics, won gold medal in the backstroke at Barcelona. Had three uh, Olympic games that I won to Seoul, Barcelona, Atlanta. Very lucky that I came out on top in Barcelona and winning the 200 backstroke. Gold medal? Yes. Yeah, you've got a gold medal? Yes. And he's coached a couple guys here just recently, Jace Crawford and Cole Crane, who are at the University of Florida and University of Texas now, but also beginning what could be an amazing Olympic journey of their own as they go through qualifying. Well, it's very interesting. They both qualified in the same two events, the 100 and 200 meter butterfly. You know, they both have very good work ethics and a lot of talent too. Um, they will have to swim really well if they want to get to the semifinal round. So they will have to do their best time by quite a bit to make it to that second round. How does it make you feel as a coach though? I mean, these are guys, I'm, I'm sure you watch the blood, the sweat, the tears. Yes, put in the work and the hard work pays off. And for them, you know, get into Olympic trials. I mean, that's just one step away from the biggest sporting event in the world. So tonight we'll watch and see if Cole and Jace can put their name on the Episcopal Olympians board up there with Nancy Hogshead and Makara. We'll be watching intently tonight only on NBC 12. Folks, don't forget the U.S. Olympic team trials continue tonight on NBC 12 and for the next few weeks. So here's a quick look at that schedule right now for you on your screen. A lot of swimming and my favorite track and field that's coming up again. All of this, all the action you can catch right here on NBC 12.